All right, guys, the first way you can make money not pressure washing is painting. Now, before you click off the video, just wait till you hear the prices that you can make painting and how easy it is. We're going to quickly walk you through this setup here. Now, we on a scissor lift here, so you'll have to include that in your price, maybe as an add-on. But this stuff pays really good, and it's really easy to do. We wash this stuff all the time. And if you ever see it needing painted, you can approach your customer and talk to them about you painting it. You don't need any special equipment other than a lift. You wouldn't want to do a ladder. But all you need is a couple guys with paint brushes, some direct metal paint. It's called DTM. You buy it from Sherwood Williams. Now, it's kind of expensive, about $50 per gallon in my area. So that's why we're going to talk about what we charge and the reason why it's so much. Because you've got several things going for you. But the good news is we're not running a pressure washer. We're not spraying detergents and sodium hypochlorite other than when we wash it. But so when you start painting, you don't have a lot of it out of pocket expenses. These brushes are about $10 each. Usually, to be honest with you, we use them for about a day and then we toss them after that because this metal framing really beats your brush up. See, you don't want to use nothing really expensive like a $50 brush would be an overkill. So a 10 or $12 four inch paint brush with some direct to metal paint from Sherwin Williams DTM, latex, all all base would work either one would work today we're using a latex i'll show you another little trick before we talk about the price you may talk about the drips well if you're using latex or either all base paint see that water hose right there i'm wetting all of this concrete that way if we do drip on it it doesn't stick to the concrete and washes right off with the water hose it can sit on there for hours on that wet concrete without sticking so instead of having to cover up that's what we're doing. Now, if you get some on the wall, obviously you need a rag with you to wipe that off before it dries. But you could wet the wall too. Just don't wet your work area, which is these support things. Now, this is a, a red color. It's pretty common in the painting industry. And this is another way that you can make a lot of money not pressure washing you may have not even thought about. So let's talk about the price here for a second. This may surprise you. We get about $4 per linear foot per side. So these sections are about 25 feet long and it's $4 per side. So each beam's about $200. Now that does include the lift, it includes the paint, it includes the prep work. But to be honest with you, we washed this in about an hour a few days ago. So now you know that you can definitely make a good bit of money doing some painting. And again, it's not that hard. A paintbrush, a bucket of paint, a lift, but you can get at your local rental store and you can get after it and make a few thousand dollars in one afternoon like we are. So stay tuned for your number two tip about how to make money, not pressure washing. So guys, the second way you can make a lot of money, not pressure washing. And trust me, before you click off to your next video, you really got to see this because this could give you a lot of great ideas. So, of course, we do pressure washing and parking lot striping. We teach that on BillyDavisonVIP.com. There'll be a link in the description as always. But this is neither either or. This is a vacuum. This is artificial turf. Now, it does really good on picking up trash and litter. And also, some of our clients want us to vacuum their yard. We're, and look, we're not landscapers and we're not pretending to be one. And we don't want to be one. But this pays $75 per hour per person, per vacuum. We do it all the time and we get paid for it. Also, Apex takes this vacuum around his local area and vacuums up gas station litter. The little bit of trash that's in a gas station, around a gas station. I'm gonna tell you something about that. It could give you a great idea. So make sure you stay tuned. But he goes in and vacuums up the cigarette butts and the litter. This thing kind of mulches it as well. And the bag, as you see there, holds the debris or the litter. And he does four or five of them on a weekend. And he charges $75 per gas station. And what you need to do is get your business card. And you can say litter pickup or litter control, get, specializing in gas station, doctor's offices, things like that. And what happens during the wintertime when all the leaves fall and the wind is blowing, most of the time out of the north, 
it piles up the trash al along the curbing or something at a gas station and it looks awful and the gas station needs that cleaned and they especially right now in the labor shortage they don't have the personnel to go out there and sweep all that stuff up and remove it they barely got enough people to run the gas station itself to sell you gas so litter control litter pickup of course you're gonna work but 75 dollars an hour is better than nothing and if you don't have a lot of money to spend you can get one of these little blower vacs for a couple hundred dollars i think this one was uh actually bought at home depot for about 200 dollars two cycle and as you hear it now he's got it on about a quarter throttle this thing will really inhale a lot of litter quickly and again it mulches it it reduces it I guess about 15 to one. So you can go quite a while and then you unzip the bag and go dump it in a dumpster or a trash can and go at it again. Again, $75 an hour. It's a way you can make money not pressure washing. And before we get to the third and final way you can make money not pressure washing, I want to urge you to go visit Billy Davidson VIP.com. That is my website that has video training that can help you grow your pressure washing business so you can stay busy 365 days a year and if you have made it this far in a video please leave a comment of any extra ways that you know how you can make some money not pressure washing so for the third and final way yes it is window cleaning if you're not familiar with window cleaning you do need some equipment for it. this equipment setup cost me about one thousand dollars for the tank and pole this is a di system bought from windowcleaningresources.com and it is very simple to do and you can make as much as $250 per hour cleaning windows with a one-man setup. Again, $250 an hour. It's very easy to do, just a pole, a water hose, and some elbow grease and you can make $250 an hour. Again, guys, I'm Billy Davidson here with Billy Davidson, VIP.com, helping you grow your pressure washing business one video at a time. Thanks for subscribing. Don't forget to hit that like button, and I surely hope to see you in the next video.